By way of introduction, the township of Lakewood, as well as the state of New Jersey, has been pounded by, by 11 storms this past winter. The department that's tasked with dealing with these storms is the Department of Public Works. As we all know, there are many different departments in Lakewood Township. You have the police department, you have EMS, you have finance department, tax office, finance office, registrar's office, clerk's office, inspection department, many different departments. But the department that is single-handedly tasked with dealing with the preparation for a storm, implementation of the, of the solution, as well as, as well as cleanup in the aftermath, is Department of Public Works. And Public Works has gone through a lot this year with regard to the storms that took place. Whether it's prior to the storms with assaulting, plowing during the storms, and now afterwards dealing with the daunting task of filling the enormous amount of potholes that we have. And some of these potholes are crater-sized and huge. I am proposing from the Mayor's office change. Public Works, with the amount of phone calls that I've received during this busy winter season, I've received numerous phone calls as well as many ideas. And I listen to ideas. I've never claimed to be the know-it-all here in Town Hall. I love when people call to share their ideas. And at this point, I'm proposing some major changes in the Department of Public Works. First and foremost, I'd like to thank profusely Tony Arecci for his many, many years of service that he's given to Lakewood Township. Tony has come early on as, a, as an entry level. He helped out with the construction of the building of the new Public Works building that we currently utilize. And Tony has grown. He has utilized his strengths and grown throughout the years that he's here. We wish him well with all his future endeavors. One of the big changes that I'm looking to do right now is making a satellite office of the mayor's office in Department of Public Works. When you go down to the Department of Public Works building, you will see an office there from the office of the mayor. Either myself or my designee will be at this office to enhance and to have a hands-on approach to dealing with some of the public's issues, things that we're called about. From time to time, we see phone calls with regard to bulk pickup, new garbage pails that are necessary, or potholes, whatever it may be. For the most part, everything's run smoothly, but when you run into a glitch, I want to have someone there from the mayor's office to assist hands-on to be able to further enhance the feasibility of working the interoperability between the mayor's office and the Department of Public Works. One of my mentors early on in the Department of Public Works, John Franklin, who is fondly referred to as Mr. Lakewood, John has explained to me in the past one of his philosophies he used to have when it came to the drivers of Public Works vehicles. And part of the philosophy was he would tell the drivers, pick it up today because after the customer calls, I'll make you go back and pick it up tomorrow. Of course, that doesn't hold true for everything. There are times where you have a, uh, a garbage pail which might be too close to a parked vehicle and therefore the truck might not be able to get to it. Let me explain exactly what I'm referring to. Let me get hold of a garbage pail. Here we have our trusty, rusty garbage pail. And with the garbage pail, we have a parked car. If the car is parked too closely to the garbage pail, the truck will not be able to get the garbage pail away safely from the vehicle. So it's imperative that the, that the garbage pail be moved from the vehicle a good three feet minimum for clearance for the arms to get around the garbage pail. That is important. If the, tr if the pail is too close to the vehicle, the truck will not be able to get to it. The driver does not get out of the vehicle for safety reasons. However, if your garbage was not picked up in a timely fashion, please notify us so we can send the truck the following day or whenever it might be later on that day to pick up the vehicle, to pick up the trash can. If you do pass by on garbage pickup day, someone whose trash can is too far, is too close to the vehicle, please take the initiative on your own and just move the garbage pail over so that that person's garbage will not get passed over. In any case, getting back to the change which, I'm, which I am proposing for Department of Public Works. First and foremost, something which we've spoken about briefly and now we're going to take it on a much more serious level. There are changes coming to the Ta Lakewood Township website. The same way we've had in the tax office now, you can now pay your taxes online. So too in Public Works, we'll be having a ticket system where instead of waiting on the phone or trying to reach an operator or, 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 or speaking with someone from Public Works, which is, with just a few clips, clicks of the mouse, you'll be able to order bulk pickup, request a new garbage pail, if you new construction, and, or try to report a, or, or report a pothole. Your time is important. No need to sit on hold waiting to speak to someone in Public Works. With a few clicks of the mouse, you'll be able to take care of these items. And for those people that don't have computer access or access to the internet, I have another solution. Not my own, but gleaned from the public. And that is opening Public Works for later hours. The office staff will be there for later hours. What I mean to say is as follows. Currently, when you call Public Works, Public Works front office works from 7.30 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. By 3.30, the phones get closed. What happens at 4 o'clock when you call? You need bulk pickup. You need you some issue. There's a dead squirrel in the middle of the roadway, dead raccoon in the middle of the roadway, something which needs to be resolved. 
That office should be open until 5 o'clock, the same way Lakewood Township is open until 5. And it's something I'm working on right now together with Public Works to be able to have coverage in that office so that when you call at 4 o'clock, 4.30 and 4.45, you'll be able to get service as well. This will be the new, all new Public Works, the rebranding of Public Works, to be able to have more services. Enhanced services, and when people call, they should feel that they're being answered, they feel they should be getting attention, and feel that their issues are being resolved. Last but not least, I want to remind the public, these ideas are not my own. They came from people like you. People who've called me with ideas. People have called me with suggestions. I appreciate suggestions. We bring them in, discuss them, weigh them, and then from there, implement them. So again, I thank those who have brought these suggestions to me. I absolutely will be working on them, and I request from the public further suggestions for me to study and implement. Thank you.